What up guys, so I compiled this HD version of Bochum's Battlefield and Mario 64 and I thought I'd show off a bit about what it's about. You may remember me uploading this video like a few days ago, but I completely messed up, I didn't put it in 60 FPS and I showed way too little. So uh, let's reshoot this video. First of all, I, wanna, I just want to collect a few of the original stars. I already collected five, so this won't take too long. And I'm kinda okay at Mario 64, so... Yeah. You may notice it lags a little, uh, that's because my computer just can't keep up recording and also playing this game in 60 FPS. It's just, uh, it's a bit sad. But maybe you at home can enjoy the full 60 FPS, unlike me who's at like 40. I didn't make a 30 FPS version of this because I really didn't want to. Um, yeah. So you only need one more star and then we can move on to the green stars that I've added to this game. There are three new green stars in this game. Um, basically the green stars, they try to make you play the orange. oh god. I really thought I would clip, but I guess not. Either way, the green stars, they try to make you play the original game again, but puts a little twist on it, so that is really worth replaying it. Yeah, you know what, at least we got to see this nice 60 FPS chain jump breaks the gate cutscene. That's, that's worth something, right? I, I messed up the bomb clip almost on purpose. Just so I could see the beautiful cutscene at 60 FPS. That's it. Yeah, okay, let's move on to the green stars. So it always says green star, then the star symbol, he's free, and then which star to collect Mario wings to this guy. So basically you have to collect the Mario wings to this guy star, but with the chain jump chasing you. Uh, kind of like the Cosmic Clones or the Green Demon Challenge, if you remember the Green Demon Challenge in Mario 64. It used to be really popular. Please don't kill me. Yeah, we're gonna loop around once. He just always homes at you, so that's the best way to avoid him. Alright, now we just need to loop around the mountain once and then, oh god, invisible walls. Nice! Yeah, we used the collision from the original Mario 64, and if you remember the original Mario 64, it had quite a few of these invisible walls over Bomber's Battlefield. I didn't think I would hit one in my video, but whatever. It's fine. I promise that was not made by me. Well, I mean, we almost used the original collision. The only difference is that um, the free defense uses a new collision to accommodate for it being 3D instead of the old 2D thing. Yeah, it's not just HD textures, we also remodeled all the polygons. Or, well, we smoothed them out, we didn't remodel every single one. So, the original Bomber's Battlefield was around a thousand polygons, this one is around 8,000. A lot of people didn't even notice that I reshaped the geometry. Uh, I'm not sure if that means I did such a good job that it was not noticeable, or if I did a poor job so it didn't even look better. But if you look at the edges, they are a lot smoother. Also, yeah, the lag. When trees are on screen, it lags a lot. Alright, there's our green star. The next few green stars are more interesting than this one, I promise. Well, I mean, the second one maybe not so much, but the third one is really cool. So the second one, um, green star, speedy comment, find the 8 red coins. Let's do that. We need to collect the 8 reds in 50 seconds. And every time we collect a red coin, the timer increases a little. So this mission is pretty easy. A lot easier than the first one. The reason the first one is so difficult is that this was made for a ROM hacking competition by Simple Flips. And um, yeah, I had to balance it for like Simple Flips difficulty. And since Simple Flips is pretty good at Mario, yeah. You have to be somewhat good to beat this. But you know what? This is on emulator, luckily. You can just use save states. So, there's no shame in admitting you are worse than Simple Flips. A lot of us are. So just go ahead and use save states if you can't beat it without... Unless you really love challenge. Yeah, you see, we still have like 30 seconds left. Well, we only need one red coin and I know where it is. But yeah, it's, it's kind of unfair because I already know the route, so... If you do this for the first time, you'll probably need like two or three tries, because you won't know where exactly to walk. 
So saying this is easy is not really fair. It's one of those missions that you have to do twice or thrice and then you can beat it. And before that it's like impossible. And afterwards it's easy. I think that's a very nice way to put difficulty. Something where you're gonna need a few tries because you improve your art while doing it. But you can do it right away. Like there's no knowledge that you need, it's just planning. And it's the last star, green star, Koopa's bad. So there, this is the coolest mission. There's a Koopa here, and he invented a new game that is about collecting, oh my god, all oh, the trees are on, on the screen, the trees, ah. See Mario, I've invented a new game, try to collect as many coins as you can within 30 seconds, if you beat my high score, I will give you a star, what do you say? I really like this. I might use this in other romics as well. So basically, you wanna kill things, collect coins, and that gives you points. And if you can hit 2,000 points, he will give you a star. So I already have a rod for this as well. You're probably gonna do something different here. There are a lot of ways you can beat this mission, I'm sure. I wonder what the actual high score is you can get. 2.6k, that's enough. Yep, that's all the stars I've added to this game. I hope you guys enjoyed and uh, the download is in the description so you can go check this out for yourself and I'll see you guys in the next video which hopefully will be about Super Mario Sunshine 64 or Super Mario Odyssey 64 which one is a part of Sunshine to Mario 64 and the other one is a reimagination of Odyssey with a completely new courses but designed as Mario 64 levels also in Mario 64. I hope you guys are looking forward to that and I'll see you around.